Hello guys, what's going on? Today we're going to do some surgery on this rotary tool. Hey guys, David here. Welcome to the channel. So today we're doing some surgery on the Dremel tool, the Dremel 4300. I have it here taken apart already. Uh, they use these uh, star head screws. And they are kind of a pain if you don't have a thin star head screwdriver. So I have this one here. I had to try to open this hole up a little bit better. Got this unscrewed. If the uh, Dremel stops working for you guys, the first thing you should check are the brushes. Now I did a video on the brushes not too long ago. And I mean, they've ground down a little bit. They still have some life in them. But always check your brushes first, replace them. If they're really thin and see if that fixes the problem if not then you can unscrew them try and see what the problem could be after investigating and doing some surgery on it my problem was this piece here it's a, called like a field it's called a field uh, housing kind of like a force field so how did I know that this was broken well there is a little connector contact connector clip and it was not it was broken off how did that happen I have no clue so Here's like the main shaft, and here's the field. All right, and so if you can see this, this one right here is broken. There's supposed to be two little metal clips like this. This one has the one. I had it in here somewhere probably fell out. So I have the replacement. This is the model number. You can always go to Dremel, their website, or call them up. They can assist you there. So uh, let's see if I can get this back to working. Alright, here's the new part. You can see all the metal clips. And this one's missing that one. Alright, so it's pretty much just plug and play. Attached, clicked in, get the shaft in there. Okay. Uh, we just put this piece back on. Quickly screw this back on. Tightly snug them up, not too tight. Alright, now I put in the brushes. Alright, the other one. Alright, 
Then we got the hanger on, but let me plug it in and see how it works. All right, there we go. Moment of truth. Plugged in. Let's see if it works. Oh man, really? All right, guys, I have no idea what's wrong with this. I need to figure this out. We'll be right back. All right, guys, I unscrewed it back up. Let's figure this out. Short, something simple. Let's see here. Switch here. Okay. Everything's tight in there. I mean, everything should be good. The brushes are touching. Wiring is good. Plastic. All right. Let's see if we can try it again without tightening all the screws. All right. And just carefully plug it in. Okay. Let's see. There we go. Yes. Woohoo! Back in business. Let's tighten these up and then give it another try. All right, I'm happy now. So you guys, gotta, I'm gonna just double check things. I think your tool's broken. It could be something simple, you know. You don't need to throw away your good tools. This is a Dremels. Dremels are well, are well built. This should last a long time if taken care of. Feeling much better now. Just trying to help you guys. Alright. Everything's good. Okay. We got the hanger. Alrighty. It is working good as new. So that's a nice relief. Get this flex shaft back on here. There goes the screwdriver. Okay, dokie. Yep, no, no. Alright guys, so that's gonna be it for this video. I hope it helps. You know, simple little part, five, six dollars, and we're back in business. So I'll leave links so it can help you guys, you know, links to the drum roll site and uh, customer support. You can chat with them, send them photos of some of the issues you might be having and they can help you. And then they can tell you which part you should need and you order it from them. Alright guys, so thanks for watching. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe and hit that notification bell to know when more videos come out. So until next time, catch you laters. Bye-bye.